Responding to emergencies here in Madison will be faster than ever for area firefighters. Now off-duty first responders will be able to provide life-saving care thanks to an app. Our Brittany Paris explains. When it comes to cardiac emergencies, seconds can mean the difference between life and death. The longer it takes to get a 911 responder there or somebody doing bystander CPR, the less likely it is that the person's going to recover. To cut down on response times and save more lives, the Madison Fire Department is partnering with Pulse Point, an app already launched in Madison that notifies CPR trained volunteers when someone is having a heart attack in a nearby public place. But with 74% of cardiac arrests in Madison happening at home, this pilot program takes it a step further. So the Verified First Responder Program allows us to actually go into people's private residence if they're in a cardiac arrest. Assistant Chief of Personnel Chase Stedman says Madison is just one of four cities selected for the program. Um, it's, it's an honor for us knowing that, um, that, we, that we are trusted with um, obviously not just our ability to do our jobs when we're on duty, but we're trusted to do our jobs when we're off duty as well. Well. Any off-duty firefighter who's downloaded the app gets a notification when there's a cardiac emergency. If they're within a quarter mile of the victim, they can respond. 100 Madison firefighters and paramedics will be carrying around one of these AEDs donated by Phillips. Now a unit like this costs anywhere between $1,000 and $1,500. Basically, every second that passes when a person isn't receiving CPR or defibrillation, their chances of survival diminish. And when seconds matter, remove clothes from patient's chest. Having a first responder nearby means more Madison lives saved. Saving lives is certainly what we're expected to do, but now giving us the ability to do it when we're off duty is, is even more, more important for us. In Madison, I'm Brittany Paris, WISC News 3. Now, the pilot program runs through December of 2018, but the Madison Fire Department hopes to keep it going beyond that.